What's up, everyone? I'm here to check some beaver sets again. Seems like a storm's blowing in. We were supposed to get a bunch of snow last night, but I think they were off now. Something's blowing in right now. Up here is where I have a snare and I added a corner bear, which I don't, I'm still thinking it was only just the one beaver. Got my snare right there. It's still set up. My conibear bear looks like it's still in place unless a muskrat, because there's tons of rat droppings on everything here. That's kind of why I didn't want to put a conibear bear in a run here. You can see some beaver tracks here. Why I set up here, there's one of their caster mounds. There's ripping the roots out here. There's this nice run going up to it. And exactly what I thought. Why I didn't want to set it up. There's 3.30, got a nice run coming off of the main little creek there. Coming right up in here. All them rat droppings and what do we got? big rat and <laughs> a blile. I even spread my triggers as wide as I could. <laughs> All right, well, we'll have to get him taken out of there. So I'll have to stab you in the water here. Hopefully my phone don't flop into the water. One thing about muskrats is they don't give you a lot of leverage for uh, setting your springs. Tell you what, that water is cold here. Guess it is winter. using one of these stands.
the stand stabilizing it. The sticks I'm using just so I can use a little dive stick here. Muskrat. There's the set remade right in that run. Like I said, the stand stabilizes it down in that run, but them sticks I just used to hold my dive stick in place, and then I just put a little wad of wet weeds over top of where the springs are setting there. Grab a muskrat, let's go check the rest. But I knew that was gonna happen. You can see a nice trail. They're coming out of there, chewing up there. But like I said, that could be just that one beaver here. So there is very little sign of there being multiple beavers here. You can pile some coyotes up on this sawdust mound. Look at that. Dug his own little hole and took a crap in it. Bobcat and coyotes all using this big mound of sawdust playing around in it. Maybe next season we'll coyote trap it. Not gonna set coyote traps in there now. It's our season ends this Saturday. A couple days. And plus that sawdust region solid. Throw our rat there. We'll walk down here. That's real quick. Probably only give these sets another night or two. Then we're gonna drop back down into the teens and I'm not gonna wanna be chopping the ice off of them. And plus, like I said, I have my doubts of there being more than maybe one more beaver here just cause that last one had some bites in its tail, but that could have been on its travels up into here. Could you go down a mile or even up a mile? There's more colonies on other properties. Oh, well, we got a set off double long. That ain't good. At least it's still laying in the bed. Uh, not like it grabbed a hold of, if it was a beaver, not like it grabbed a hold of them. Cause it's laying perfectly in its bed still. Not foothold still set. Right here, I have a uh, conibear set up on a caster mound type deal. Like that, and this is all blocked down, but you can definitely tell there is a ton of, ton of muskrat activity in here. But, Give you kind of a general better idea here of what we're trapping. 
it's just an old 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 dam i mean there's been beaver moving in and out of here getting trapped out of here well since i could walk and back when my old man was still trapping But I'm still curious to what might have sat that trap off. Because even like a beaver, even a belly snap would have grabbed a little bit of something. And he would have taken off with But we'll see. We'll reset it. And if not, there's... A run coming down through there and a run coming right down through here if all else fails if i see like some fresh caster mounds going on after catching that one we'll plug them two runs up with 330s see what happens can keep the muskrats out of them long enough for the beaver to get into it uh i think we'll do good if there is a beaver still in here that snap trap doesn't Say there's still a beaver here. Try to see some tracks. I'm not even seeing any tracks. I mean, I think it's still laying exactly where I bedded it. So, who knows? We'll get it reset. See what might happen. Have a good one, everyone.